the how safe is this country? Some stigma, yeah. some discrimination. No. Just don't and get scammed. Don't tend to touch the pediatric medical institute. So thank you for giving us valuable time. Make it crisp and fast. Also, I wanted to ask like many students from India who come here. So the main goal will be like going to US, UK. Uh, for that, the, is this university certified uh, like ECFMG certified? Yes. 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 yes of yeah. course. As I know, it's certified in as was uh, searching from WDOMS. Uh, university, which means like it is directly connected with uh, NMC, like in India. Yes. A student can get go yes. and practice in India as well. Yes. So it is ECFMG certified, right? Yes. Uh, we are from the last year okay. uh, had the status uh, uh, pathway number three, okay. and if you know, it's a pathway uh, from the first and five, okay. and now we are going to take the uh, to to bring the pathway number four. It's mean the who is a uh, uh, graduated student will go to the uh, ECFMG without uh, first step. It's mean the verification will be only online from the portal of the ECFMG. Yeah, yeah. It's mean the only our institute today has the pathway three uh, position in the ECFMG, and you can check that from the official website from the ECFMG only the. Uh, our institute from Uzbekistan, I mean the medical institute uh, from all Uzbekistan. Uh, from all Uzbekistan, only our institute has the pathway three. It's nice to hear that. Yeah, thank is, you. Because many students face problems of, after getting graduated. Yes. Yeah? yes. So yeah, another thing is uh, many like my parents itself, like many other parents from different parts of India, worry about the security of the students. Yes. Like uh, how safe is this country? Like they first fear is this Uzbekistan. The main population is. Uh, uh, Muslims. Yeah. Okay. There is like stigma in brains in different different uh, countries. Yeah. So how will you address that thing? Like how safe is this? Mm -hmm. As I know, it's very safe for students who are coming from India. Yes. Uh, just for our audience, can you please explain like two three words about how safe, how warm the people are here? Yes. For us, also the main main uh, objective is from the students and from the our side. This is a. Uh, security of the, our the students. Yeah. Uh, why? Because the, if the students will be like secured from the outside, from the inside, the students will take the good study. Yeah. So in this case, what we are doing? Uh, we are doing our the best first to to take the good hostels with the good conditions, hostel or apartments. Second one, uh, we are asking the, from the students to take care about the house. Health and uh, in Uzbekistan, if you know uh, uh, Uzbekistan healthcare system, uh, in, uh, in the emergency healthcare is totally free. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's also taking the, some care about uh, health security uh, from from the student side. It, it doesn't matter about the foreign students or local students. All the emergency care uh, is free. Is, is a free. Yeah. But sometimes we have uh, some uh, non-emergency problems uh, in students. For this one, we are asking the, from the students to uh, uh, take the, some uh, insurance, like medical insurance. Okay. Uh, maybe you can do the in India, like international medical insurance, and uh, you can take the, this one in Uzbekistan, like uh, uh, in the old time. Because yeah. the, sometimes students can take the, some uh, injections, some procedures. It, it, it's not free in Uzbekistan, but from the insurance, it will be uh, so comfortable. Yeah, third one, and uh, uh, we are giving the students the hours of student behavior regulation. Okay. Inside, uh, we are put to all the behavioral uh, regulation things. For example, we are asking the, from the students uh, if you have uh, some activities, for example, after the classes, after the 8 p.m. 8 p.m. If you have uh, some activities, some cultural, some traditional, we are asking to back to home until the 10 p.m. every every day, because uh, if you will uh, take the care about yourself, God will be take care about you. <coughs> so in these things, also we are asking take care about the like timetable. Yes, also uh, sometimes we have uh, some uh, group uh, activity until the like 11, maybe 12. Uh, until the midnight, okay, it's okay if it will be like uh, organized uh, yeah. some things. It it will take to some security, and also in the behavior regulation. Also, we are asking the to to be sure about the internet uh, information mm -hmm. because you know today we have uh, so many bad things from the internet and yeah. uh, 
uh, I, I don't want to tell you about the, some category of the information, but it's uh, it it may uh, uh, it can come from the religion, bad things, uh, information from the political, from the economical things, because you know that some students go into the some internet. Uh, I would say it, um, searching for something. Yeah, to to pay the, to some uh, internet gamers. Don't and, get scammed. Yeah. Also, before you told me about some stigma, yeah. some discrimination. No, in Uzbekistan, you are living here. I think uh, like the, your student time going here. We don't have any stigmatization, any discrimination, any others. Uh, uh, things about other nations, about other countries, uh, citizens, because uh, in Uzbekistan we are uh, multi-cultural, uh, uh, multi-national uh, society. So uh, every time and uh, anywhere we are taking the, our respect for the all uh, nations and all countries, citizens. So one last question is. Um what one message you would like to say to people who are coming to your university here? So uh, my message uh, will be about uh, like a motivated uh, message and uh, for the uh, students and uh, for the applicant uh, who is going to choose the some Uzbekistan medical universities just look to our institute because our institute today the very uh, modern uh, uh, IT modern institute and uh, also our the old uh, classes equipped by the last uh, educational technologies and our uh, uh, more than the 70 percent of the professors has uh, academic rank and uh, they have uh, good lectures and we have uh, uh, TBL orientated CBL orientated education in our institute and uh, otherwise our the campus very comfortable to take the study because the uh, main three campuses of the, our institute located around the one kilometer so students can uh, can take the, some walk to have uh, some classes in different uh, campus totally orientated to the clinical study so in these things our the main departments located in the republican uh, republican uh, hospital clinics so this is our the main uh, part and uh, from the international uh, ranking today our institute uh, totally accredited from the World Federation Medical Education and also before I told about the SFMG uh, certification uh, Tashkent Pediatric Medical Institute today has a pathways free certification from SFMG 2006 we have uh, so many this is like a medical statement uh, performance evaluation. For example, this is the last Korean student which is um, uh, taking the step number three and uh, she uh, applied for the medical student performance evaluation. And uh, also, you know, today the, all the international medical educations should have uh, some uh, GPA. Yes, sir. So in this case, she made uh, O1 GPA and we confirm it about this one and also we gave the some recommendation for these students this is uh, like this forum about verification yeah ECFMG. yeah ECFMG verification yeah is there students studying from korea as well right yes today we have uh, more than the 60 students from korea okay it's like multinational team international department yes it was uh, from the 2005 we had uh, uh, we had some collaboration with uh, some in, uh, uh, Korean uh, universities, and today we have uh, so many Korean students also. Okay, I hope many Indian students will pass ECFMG. Yeah, but as... today we have uh, more the Indian students. Yeah, more yeah. than the two hundred. Yeah, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you for no, your valuable no. time. Yeah.